What's up, Split Game friends? Welcome back to the channel, and mostly welcome back for another movie review. And today's review, we are going to do another Marvel movie. Another Marvel movie, and that is Iron Man 2, the third movie in the MCU. So, so the other two Marvel movies we have already reviewed, and that is Iron Man and Iron Man 2. So, if you guys haven't seen that, please go check that, please go check that out, check those video, videos out after you've seen this video. So, before we do, if you guys want to support me, please feel free to consider yourself to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and that would be awesome. So now, no further ado, let's review Iron Man 2. Yeah! So, Iron Man 2 is, direct, is a sequel to Iron Man, the, the first Iron Man movie. And it starts with, um, so we got the, um, returning actors, like Robert Downey Jr. played, um, Iron Man slash Tony Stark. Tony Stark, uh, we got, um, Gwen, uh, Gwen, uh, Gwen F. Poltro plays who plays um Pepper Potts. Uh we got um and we got um Agent Colson who is um Clark Clark Greg. I actually did look up his name before I did. Um we actually uh there is uh Basically, there's a new face, um, and that is uh, Don Cheadle, and he um, replaced Charles Terence Howard as what's his name again? Colonel Rhodes. Colonel James Rhodes. So Terence Howard played him in Iron Man One. So. Don Cheeto as to place him in Iron Man 2. So that was he did, okay? So we got new characters in there. We got um we got Justin Hammer who plays by played by Sam Rockwell and that's really cool. Um we got Samuel Jackson as Nick Fury, the director of SHIELD. We got Natasha Romanoff slash Natalie slash Black Widow played by the lovely Johan the lovely Scarlett Johansson and that's really cool and and our and our main villain in this film and that is Mitchie Rourke who plays Iron Banjo aka Whiplash. So that's who that so that the cast in this film and also um the director of this film is John Vavreau who also who also plays um he's also played um Harry Hogan in this movie and that's really cool so so now let me tell you what I think about this film. Um so my opinion on this film is that Iron Man 2 is an amazing film. I really enjoyed it. Like, like I know that Iron Man 2 wasn't the strongest out of the three Iron Man movies, but but I know it got flaws and things, but I actually enjoyed it as a movie itself. I love the characters. I love um, the story as well. Um, like seeing Nick Fury uh, in live action, see um, 
Black Widow live action. That is really cool. And and we have to see see Iron Man with wearing three new suits and that is Mark 4, Mark 5 and Mark 6. So that's the suits he built. Because in the first movie, if you guys didn't, didn't know, Tony Stark as he built Mark 1 in a cave. He built Mark he built Mark 2 in in his gar in his garage. Also um Mark 2 became his uh became Mark 3 because he repainted it as Mark 3. So so this film we got Mark 4, Mark 5, Mark 6 and that's really cool. Um so yeah. Um so let me explain about the story now. Um the story is really cool. Um because I really enjoyed it. Um uh, basically I'm not going um too detailed in, in the in the movie. So basically the movie starts with um Iron Banco in Russia who's living with his dad. Um, but his dad was dying, so uh, so after his dad died, he was um, I think he was watching about Tony Stark now telling the world that he's Iron Man. So yeah, so 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 this film it takes place after events of the first movie. So yeah, um, so after that, after his dad died. Um, he looked on his uh, plans of, of uh, I think it was the blueprints of the art reactor, and he was about to build his, about to build the art reactor. He did. Well, recreate it, and then, then there was a scene. Uh, I'll, I'll put up a few scenes. Um, this scene we see was really cool. Uh, I man Ashley, um. Um, came. Um, he actually made a grand entrance into in the in the dark expo, and he actually took it off in in front of everyone as Tony Stark. The Tony Stark as he told the public who he was, and then he shows off the video of his dad about the expo and thing and. But guys, there's something you didn't know. Um, Tony Stark in the movie was really ill. Uh, basically, basically he was dying, and he was testing out his blood. Basically, it's um, basically, I, uh, basically the art reactor is killing him. Basically, uh, so so yeah, um, uh, so so next couple of scenes, um, there was there is a scene where Iron Man. Well, Tony Stark and Pepper Potts was in the court room with Jonathan Hammer, and they were talking about his suits being a weapon. But, but, but Iron Man, Tony, well, Tony Stark, telling them, "Look, my suits are not weapons. I just built them to protect people. When I said I'm not doing weapons anymore." It doesn't mean I'm making more weapons. So, 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 so guys, the comment in the movie thinks Tony Stark is making new weapons, basically. And, they, and he's like, no, 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 no. They're not weapons, they're suits. You, like, Iron Man and Tony Stark are one. And that's what he said to them. And they got in um, uh, Justin Hammer, who, um, who the games Tony Stark and he wants to build his own suits. That's what he's trying to do. Because because the government wants Tony Stark's property. He wants his suits. And he said to them, look, you're not having them. They're my property. They're not yours. You're not you're not keeping them. They're mine. I built them. You didn't do it. You built I built them. You you haven't my suits. So that's what he said. That, that's what he said, guys. Um, 
and then Daddy saw his friends at Trevor Rose. Trevor Rose guys was on Justin Thomas' side. I was like, what? I saw that guys. I was like, what? He's on Justin Thomas' side. I thought you were on Charlie Stocks. So then, um, they were explaining about that there, about the debate thing over Charlie Stocks' suits, and Charlie Stocks actually hacked into the screen. Sorry, the screens on at the front, and he hacked into them, trying to see the um, the, the CCTV um, footage of footages of Justice Hammer's um, testing on his suits. So he actually did that, and Tony Dodge made a suggestion. He said, "Look." If you want my search, you can't have them. Because look, I'm Tony Dodge and I do everything I want. I'm gonna save people and for you can't have my suits. So there was the the senator was absolutely he was absolute an asshole in this. Like an asshole. Like sorry for my language. Like an a hole. He, he's an idiot. Like tutu an idiot. And and, and Tony Dodge did have a good point. Like, he built them, not him. So after that, um, because, after that, we saw, um, Iron Banco actually built his m metallicalized whips with the arc reactor energy in them. So, after that, um, the few years later, Tony Dodge went back home. He went back home, um, him and Pepper Potts having this argument about about the rappers. Um then then basically um if I remembered uh basically um he promoted uh Pepper Potts as the new CEO of Dark Industries and that's what he did and then um then um there was this uh, daddy meets uh, Natalie in the in the gym, and that was pretty cool. And then a few few scenes later, uh, he went he goes to Italy for the Grand Prix race, and he meet Justin Hammer again. Then he uh, decided to do decided to. We played the driver the the, the the race in his own race car that we did, and after all that racing he did, Ivan Van guys was in Italy, wanted his revenge on Tony Dodge. He wanted to kill him. He wanted to kill him. Yeah, he wanted to kill him. So, so he got there, guys. He got there. He got there, and then um, he got whip side. He whipped all the race cars, tried to kill Tony Dodge. There is this scene I really love, oh my god, where we see Toy Dark suit up in his Mark 5. So the suit we saw in the beginning was Mark 4. And in, in Mark 5 was the, um, was the suit that was designed to, to disguise as a briefcase and he can, he can like, you know, suit up. And, and it was red and silver, and that was really, 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 really cool to see that. I really loved that scene. And then Ivan Rancho actually got um, arrested, and and then he went into jail. And then, <coughs> then after that, he was broke out by um, Justin Hammer, who wants his help. So after all that, he wants him to build his suits, have built the suit like Iron Man does. Um, but, um, did, did, like, all that kind of stuff. The, the natural scenes where, where Tony Dodge was in his, um, uh, mansion. And in his mansion, guys, sorry I was looking over there because I was, sorry about that, a bit nervous. So basically, he was in mansion having his birthday party, and guys, let me tell you, 
Tony Stark was in his Iron Man suit drinking. He was completely drunk. He probably he was completely drunk and he was blasting everything. Um Papa Potts tried to tell him to stop um that toy for the night and he doesn't do it. Didn't listen. So Rose decided to 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 suit up in, in his March March two suit. So after that he totally wanted to go home and there was a so Tony Stark and him I mean, a fight a fight scene. He's very tall, really tall. Um, but the Tony Stark asked asked the, the DJ <laughs> to put this song. He said it is a DJ, please put something so I can beat my best friend too. <laughs> so he did that, um so after that, after this fight scene, um, Rose actually took his Iron Man suit away. Iron Man suit with him. And he actually went to the military. Um, he actually asked uh, Dot Hammer for weapons and everything. So basically after all that, um, Tony actually meets some some of Jackson aka Nick Fury. And he, he tells them who, 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 who they are, everything, and all that stuff. It's very really cool. So, so then, um, you see he's off as Black Widow, and then um, the next couple of scenes, uh, I'm uh, like to tell them they're doing no detail. The next couple of scenes, um, Iron Man was, um, if I remembered, Iron Man was. Um, Was um, being gifted his dad's um, um, work in a big, um, big um, silver, like a like a, a a big trunk. He gave him, and it full of dad's work, the same blueprint as I Vangel got, and everything. And he was he was his dad's old. Um, Tapes as he does, as he did. This one of them actually was so was really emotional, where his dad was talking about him, and he got his meteorized uh, model of the Stark Expo he actually got, and he said, he said his greatest greatest great creation was him. So basically, he wanted Tony Stark to fulfill his legacy. That's what he did, and. Then, um, back to Ivan, he actually, uh, built drones. Just Hammer was very happy, so he actually, uh, went after him, um, he told him that, that, the, 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 he said, look, we had a deal, you told me, you, you, you told me that you built suits, like Iron Man, and he went, uh, drones better, you know? Like, Mickey Rourke plays him really well. Like, I really like Mickey Rourke. He's amazing. Like, an awesome uh, actor. He, he, he's awesome in this. And he's, uh, basically, he had two, he had, um, two, um, bodyguards. He, like, he, like, he, like, whatever. So, he actually, um, so I, I, Doc Espo, uh, Justin Hammer was doing the presentation. Before that, Iron Man was creating a new source of energy for his for his reactor. So that's what he did. And then, then after that, um, he go to Doc Espo in Mark Six. And he got a triangle, guys. He had a triangle chess piece. And that was really cool. And he goes there, see, you see the drones have been being presented uh, for the Navy, the Marines, the Air Force, the Army, everything. And then, uh, see James Rolls in War Machine outfit, War Machine suit. That's really cool. And then, guys. Ivan Vanko actually hacked the um, drones. He used them to destroy everything, all of them. 
he tried to try to kill uh, Tony Stark, but then but he tried to. Um, so Romanoff and Happy goes after him, goes after him, and then she was building, building them all the all the bodyguards and think. And after that, um, she uh, got into the the computer, tried to reboot a uh, war machine suit, and now she does that. So basically, I man the war machine at a a fight scene in the. Like a, a world, uh, uh, as in a globe structure they were in. And then, after that, uh, that was rebuilt, they were um, surrounded, were surrounded by drones. Iron Man took them out. And then, Iron Man told Tom's in his own suit. And he got whips again, he tried to kill them. But... They actually uh, did that hand thing, and it destroyed the suit, but he's still alive. Then they got all the suits, all the drones are self-destruct, so all of them, so they had to actually escape from there. And then, I might actually save um, Pepper Potts just in time, Run, went on to the um, building. And guys, there was a scene where a little kid wearing an Iron Man mask and he got um, like a repulsor blast toy thing. And I'm not telling you who, who that was, who that is. I'm not telling you till, till the next few episodes away. So, I'm not telling you. Um, so, yeah, um, so, so... So Iron Man and Pepper was on on the roof, having have an amazing moment, and they had their first kiss. I'm like, oh, that's so cute. And they <laughs> me on my child. <laughs> Roddy guys was there, and he's like, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I saw a fit. Yeah, I heard. I heard. I heard. But you quitting or just so blah blah blah. And Troy's like, wait, how long you been there? How long you been there? He went, oh, oh, I was here first. So he goes, oh, he goes, oh, Tony, I need to lend your suit for a minute. So I need to get back home. So he went, ah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> that is really funny. So after that, um, that was pretty cool. So after that, um, Tony um, had a meeting with Samuel Jackson about the about the the, the initiative um, the initiative uh, project they were doing, and they're not uh, recruiting Iron Man in this in this because they want him as a consultant because he was doing um, because of it because of his bad behavior. So after that, uh, he needs he needs a favor. So Senator actually uh, was sent to that what uh, Roddy and himself with uh, medals, medals. And Tony Stark went that <laughs> he went that guy. He went that. He went like I love it, Gosa. I love it. it Mean peace. I love it. And then it then the movie ends, and I. Really ends, and guys, that was the story of Iron Man 2. I really love that. It's really cool. The story is really cool. Um, I love the suits. I love the characters. And guys, that is the review of Iron Man 2 that came out back in 2010. Uh, let me tell you, uh, so this is my final thoughts. Iron Man 2. It's a great film. If you haven't seen this, if you haven't seen it, please, I highly recommend you guys to watch it. It's really cool. So, so, so once again, if you guys haven't seen my Iron Man and Iron Man, well, The Incredible Hulk movie reviews, please go watch them, and, and that would be awesome. So, guys, this is the end of the review. Once again, this is the end of the review. Um, overall the film is very cool 
and I just want to say thank you so much for watching and most of all if you guys want to support me please feel free to consider yourself to subscribe to the channel and like the video leave a comment down below and and in the next review I will be reviewing Thor the God of Thunder and that will be next Friday after I done Batman Return to Arkham Asylum Part 10. So so once again thank you so much for watching and, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So see you later again. Take care of yourselves and most of all, like always, stay awesome my friends.